Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. On the morning of April 11, 2024, the Russian Federation unleashed a devastating assault on the Tripilia thermal power plant, employing the newly deployed KH-69 cruise missile, as reported by Defense Express. This brazen act of aggression, targeting a critical infrastructure facility near Kiev, Ukraine, underscores the escalating tensions and the severe impact of military conflict on civilian infrastructure. The KH-69 cruise missile, a recent addition to the arsenal of Russian forces, remains shrouded in mystery, with limited details divulged about its combat capabilities, including range and warhead type. Nevertheless, insights gleaned from previous reports shed light on its design and potential impact. Designed for deployment on tactical aviation aircraft such as the Su-34 and Su-35, with future integration planned for the Su-57, the KH-69 boasts a formidable range exceeding previous estimations. Initially touted with a range of up to 290 kilometers, practical tests have revealed its capability to reach even greater distances. Armed with a warhead weighing up to 310 kilograms, the missile's guidance system leverages satellite navigation with jam-resistant antennas, comedium antennas, and inertial guidance. A distinguishing feature of the KH-69 is its ability to operate at exceptionally low altitudes, flying as low as 20 meters, a tactic that enhances its stealth capabilities and evasive maneuvers, posing significant challenges to air defense systems. Despite its subsonic nature and smaller warhead compared to the hypersonic KH-47M2 Kintel, the KH-69's precision and evasion tactics make it a formidable weapon in modern warfare scenarios. The airstrike on the Tripilia thermal power plant, a critical hub for Ukraine's electricity supply, dealt a severe blow to the nation's infrastructure and economy. With a production capacity of 1,800 megawatts, Tripilia played a pivotal role in stabilizing the national grid, particularly following the decommissioning of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant in 2000. Its strategic importance extended beyond Kiev, serving as a linchpin for regional energy supply and economic stability. The targeted destruction of such vital infrastructure underscores the dire consequences of military conflict on civilian populations and essential services. As Ukraine grapples with the aftermath of this devastating attack, the international community must renew efforts to de-escalate tensions and seek diplomatic solutions to resolve the ongoing crisis in the region. That's all for now. See you later.